Hey guys, good morning. Um, it is the week before Memorial Day. Today's Monday. The f next Monday is Memorial Day. We're back up on Pine Creek and show you the river out here. The river is high, a little off color, not bad, actually pretty nice, but it's up around 1500 CFS's. We got here last night at the campground and um, fished the last maybe three hours of the evening um, up here on Pine. In the morning yesterday, we were on um, Spring Creek. Did really good. Nymphin, picked up about a dozen Nymphin, and then uh, picked up about four or five on top on sulfurs. And uh, so we had a real good, uh, well, I guess we fished it yesterday from like 8.30 to like 1.30. And um, then we hopped on up here to Pine Creek and check in and you know get ready and then fish the evening hours up on the up near the campground so let me show you what I was using this is <laughs> I don't even know what it's called because a guy gave it to me gave me a couple of them and um, it's like a shiny gold um, woolly bugger with a white marabou tail the underneath is um, red and has a uh, cone head uh, gold cone head on it and I was absolutely killing it last night on pine on that. I um, landed about 10. Uh, no, because I caught more than I probably landed about 13. And I had at least 8 or 9 get off, jump off. And it was just, I was just killing it. Um, so that's what I'm using today. We didn't see really very few fish rise yesterday. There was a lot of caddis on the water. Um, birds are working the water today uh, but no risers right now but hopefully we'll get some fish coming off if we get some decent bug activity but for the time being I'm going to be working this bugger all different angles of the stream and uh, see how we do here so we're out here it's late run right now and I'm um, going to give it a shot and I'll show you my first couple casts stay with me okay <laughs> okay guys plan B uh, nothing happening down Slate Run. Water was still pretty high. The flow was 1350, which is great from the day before yesterday. It was like 1700. But um, uh, maybe we'll revisit that later today or tomorrow. It depends. But we're back up at the campground. And we're going to see if we can have similar action that we had last night. Okay. I'm just using this little woolly bugger. And actually, I gotta get out of the creek. Show you my first couple casts. And uh, I didn't have any luck this high up, but working a streamer is almost like working a wet fly, at least the way I do it. Um, I just throw it out at like a 45 or if I want it to get a little deeper, throw it a little bit higher, let it sink, and then just jiggle it back. So, let's see, it was very effective last night, let's see if it works again like that. Hopefully these rainbows here like sunshine. Okay, that's what we got. Sunshine all day today. A little bit of clouds coming in late afternoon. Hopefully that sun warm up the rocks. Maybe get some um, better bug activity. So, okay, just show you my first couple casts. to the swing. 
There he goes. There he goes. Oh, he got off. Ha <laughs> ha. There he goes. Got a nice rainbow on there. Oh. It's probably nice. It looks like around 11, 12. There he goes again. Oh, missed him. Dang. He's coming up and smacking it. Got him on the swing. Ah. <laughs> okay, had two hits there. Let's see if I can try it again. This big switch rod, six weight. Let it go through the swing. See what we do here. I, mean, I definitely had the one hook and stung the other one, so I don't know if they'll hit again. We'll see. Try it. Let's go through that swing. I'm gonna hold out there a little further. Get into a different lane. There he goes. Oh man! <laughs> They're coming up and just whacking it. Come on, fish. I'm missing them. Try it again. Maybe, hopefully, they're just nipping the marabou tail part of it, but I'm not. Ah, kill me. Okay, let's get on the other side of this big stick I'm on. There. Go down a little further. Oh, look at it, got him. <laughs> Just walking. Right up against the bank. Yeah. Honestly, it was my fourth or fifth one. I had one hook that got off, and then I had three hits. And that one, I was just dangling in the water. What? Just dangling it. I was, I was walking around the bush. There he is. I don't know. He got off himself. Let's show you this fly again. And like I said, I do not know what the name of it is. But there you go. Red with a gold glittery... Um, I don't even know. Some type of glittery chenille. And then a white marabou tail. It's got the... Um, and I'm using a split shot real close to it. Look at that, just to get it down a little deeper. And it's got a... Um, uh, that tungsten head on it. So, there you go. See him get out there a little further. Let it go through the swing. Let it go through the swing. Get down, get down, get down. Like I said, that's how it was last night, man. I pounded him. There he goes. Oh, man, just missed him again. <laughs> man, they just come up and just... Unbelievable. Uh, get out there. After this, I'll have to shut you guys off. Lay down there. Keep it out here kind of far. Just get into a different lane. There he goes. Other one. Look at that. Unreal. There he is. I'm just dragging. I've got. Last night I had one X, but I don't have any more. So I had to put another leader on. I'm only using like three foot of mono. That's it. And I'm using two X. So these are all kind of clones of each other. All like 11 inch rainbows. Real nice. 
No, all rainbows. Okay, we'll be back. Okay, guys. <clears throat> Switched it up again now. Trying a uh, squirmy wormy right here. And then I have a La Fontaine pupa merger with a bead head. Okay, right there. And then I have the GSS Emerger right there Caddis are coming off occasional riser here or there I don't know if the fish are really keyed in on them but they weren't hitting the woolly bugger this morning they were the way they were last night so we're going to go underneath for them here see what we can do and I'm actually using an indicator so there you go oh gee I don't know what that was First cast in. Oh, good lord. I lose my stuff. Ah, I lost my stuff. Must not have tied a good knot on it. Oh my gosh. Okay, start all over. Jeez, oh man. Oh my gosh. Okay, guys. <laughs> Let's try this again. Get back to Nymphin. I'm gonna use an indicator. Let's see what happens here. Pretty fast water and deep. So I got a lot of weight on it. But I actually saw a fish rise right out in front of me. So I know they're in this fast water. Caddis are still coming off very modestly, probably lightly, I would say. Hopefully we'll get some more action here. Get these fish turned on. There he goes. There he goes. On the La Fontaine Pupa Merger. Oop. Nope. I thought he was. Unless he came off and got rehooked. That is on the GSS Emerger. Okay, man. Look at that. Got it on film for you. Yeah, he was. He was hooked on the um, LaFontaine Pupa Emerger. And it slid down. And he got caught on the GSS. Oops. Hooked up near the mouth. Okay, there you go. 11 inch rainbow. Okay. Three quarter inch one. Right there. There he goes. And that one's on, I think, the GSS Emerger. Man, that is fast water. I'm telling you, that is really fast water. <laughs> I'm catching him. Oh, there he goes. That's okay. That's cool. Ah, pretty cool. Pretty cool. I can't believe. I said this is super fast water along this pillar. I don't know how fast it is. So I'm gonna try to get out of the water here on this little island. See what I can do up here in this. It's pretty fast up here. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That is awesome. <laughs> Awesome. Now it's awesome. Hope you guys are getting a good view of this. I'm all tangled up here. And this fast water. And this is on the GSS Emerger. Look at that. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Let's get him in here. Great. Good deal. Look at that. Awesome. Okay. Okay guys, I took my squirmy off. Wasn't getting anything on it. Most of the time I just use this in a tractor. But um I put on a big stone fly. So see how that works. Big brown stone. Oh there he goes. Look at that. Boy, he hit it up there. 
And he hit the big brown stone. Wow, we. I guess it was a good switch up. <laughs> That's got a big tungsten head on it. There we go. Keeper motor. Woo! Jumping right into the cabin. Look at him. <laughs> he's awesome. No, he's on the GSS Emerger. Good lordy. You guys don't tie up that GSS Emerger you have got us around. You better tie it up. Because that GSS Emerger works. I'm telling you. That GSS Emerger works. Nice. Okay, let me get him off. Okay, guys. I have got one for you. Now, I'm gonna have to show it on film, but I wasn't even gonna show it because the very first in, very fast, the very first cast in that I was nymphing, I hooked the fish and he broke my line. And that was up there, okay? It's been 45 minutes since I started. Caught a bunch of fish already, okay? I just caught this fish and it was the same exact fish that I caught the very first that broke my line because I got my whole rig back. Is that something? Here's my rig that I lost. Here's my LaFontaine Pupa merger. Here's my GSS merger. And here is the rig that I'm fishing with. <laughs> so I got my whole rig back. Unbelievable, the same fish. I cannot believe that. That is unreal. Wow. Wow. And I'm not, I mean, I'm generally in the same area, but he was a good 30, 40 yards up that I caught him. Unbelievable. Okay, man. Get back at it. Here he goes, another one. Dang, look at that. These fish are key on. And that's on the, um, Big brown stone too. Ooh, tangling up my whole rig. Ugh. That's not cool, fish. Okay. Get this out of here. Ooh. There he goes. I think about hope I got you guys on. Okay, yes I do. <laughs> on the big brown stone. Nice, 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 nice. Big brown stones. There he goes. There he goes. Boy, the first one on the swing. There you go. First one on the swing. And that was on the big brown stone. Okay. See how we do here, nymphing. There he goes, first cast in. Look at that, first cast in. <laughs> if I didn't have a camera, <laughs> you wouldn't believe it. I actually got him on a swing. That's a nice sized fish compared to what I've been catching. And this is on the big brown stone. 
Love how those rainbows fight. Love how those rainbows fight. There we go. That was just perfect. Uh -huh. He came out all by himself. See ya. Okay, you guys, had to change spots. It was getting a little crowded down there. I had three guys all around me, which is fine, but not my thing. So, came up here to another set of rifts and see how we do up here. New set of rifts. Look at that. First cast. Oh my gosh. <laughs> First cast, first cast on the big brown stone. <laughs> Isn't that good? That's pretty good. Oh. Oh. Okay. There he is. Okay. First cast in, got one. Let's try a second cast in. hit there. Oh, maybe it's top and bottom. Yeah, because I didn't set the hook. I, uh, a little unsure there. Do one close to us. Really close. Rod length away. Yeah, I don't know why they call this Pine Creek. But I'll tell you what. This is a river. Sure isn't a creek. Okay, a nice good drift here. There he goes. Oop. There he goes. Man, he's going nuts. So, and this one is on. I don't know yet. On the GSS Emerger. There you go. On the GSS Emerger, he's going crazy. Get him in here. Okay. Okie dokie. Look at that big, probably a light Cahill. I don't know, I'm gonna call it a Drake, but there, there he goes. There he goes. Man, that was a big Mayfly. Sucker was about a size eight or 10. Okay, this guy is on. I don't know yet. He's on there. We got one on everything. This is on the Hare's Ear Soft Tackle. Okay. Hare's Ear Soft Tackle. There you go. There it is. Here's your soft tackle right there. Okay. okay, guys, backed out, came down about 10 yards, and um, hit new water, new section. So let's get out there. Work it kind of close first. Oh, oh man. Boy, it looked like he hit it a couple times. There he goes. There he goes. Oh, so much fun these rainbows. So much fun. Yeah. Now how's he hooked like that? Okay. Didn't look like that at first. I bet he. I bet he was hooked on the the um, big brown stone. When he jumped, he probably spit the hook. <laughs> and then the last fly got him. That's okay. That's okay, we'll get him off. Okay. Nice. Oh. Okay. So I try to identify which fly they're on as quick as I can. So I find out what's happening during the fight. 
Let's get back out there. Oh, there he goes. On the swing, that one was. And that one is on the GSS. Oh, there he goes. That was on the GSS Submerger on the swing. Pretty good, pretty good. Orange. <laughs> Big piece of cheddar cheese. Everything's better with cheddar. There he goes. Ha! Ha, ha, ha. On the swing. <laughs> oh, damn. Man, these boys jump. They just jump. Nice. Great current adds to the fight. Nice. Boom, there he goes. Gotta love them rainbows. Okay, let's get him up here. And he is on. Oh, he's on the back, but <laughs> like I said, I don't know. Let's uh get him up here. Come on boy, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, he's going nuts though. Come here. There he goes. Okay. Guys, had about 20 minutes there without a fish. This is on the hair's ear soft tackle. Not corn, no. <laughs> oh, there he goes. That's okay. <laughs> One of the spinning guys in front of us. Okay. Oh. Okay. One of the spinning guys. I don't know their names or anything, but... He was using corn for bait, and he was taking a handful of corn in and chumming, <laughs> and then going in and fishing. And uh, so that's where that comment came from. <laughs> Let's see what we can get here. There he goes. No, no, well, there you go. Woo! This is on the big brown stone. Yeehaw! Okay. Nice one, nice one. Okay. Nice one. Yeah. If you cooperate, I get you off in a second. <laughs> if you don't cooperate, it's a big mess. <laughs> okay. Guys, came down to this cliff here, blocking the sun, and uh, we're down below cedar. So, a lot of bugs coming off now. A lot of um. Lake Cahill is like around size 10. Birds are going nuts after them. But no fish going nuts after them. There he goes. There he goes. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. There you go. And the big brown stone. They like that big brown stone. Oh. Oh. Got off all by himself. Thank you very much. <laughs> okay, guys. Finally got some rising fish. Uh, but they are 25 yards out there. But I'm getting out to them. But I, oh, got them. Got them. Look at that. Uh, can you believe that? This is second cast out to them. Awesome. That was on Lake Cahill. 
Oh my gosh. There he goes. Not a big one, but I'll bet you there's some big brownies that are going to start feeding out there. There he goes. Oh, where's my net? There he goes. All right. All right. There you go, man, on the drive through. Okay. Okay. Okay, we got some risers over here, guys. But I got a March Brown emerger on. And these are really small rises. So I think they're taking caddis. Or blue wing dollars. I don't really know. I wish they were. There he goes. Ha! I was just going to say, well, I wish he would just come up and take a taste of it. Ha! It worked. How about that? How about that? There he goes. That's okay. That was fun. Just get getting them. Let me show you. Which brown emerger? It's kind of like a like a a comparison emerger. Okay. But um, big old boy, uh, size ten. But uh, he came up for it. There was three of them out here. So. I could put on something small, but a lot harder to see. And I don't think these fish are that smart. So let's try it again. A little close one. Standing on the bank, looking halfway across the, uh, trying to look across the creek and see if we can see risers, but these rises, you cannot see them unless you're standing on top of them. These are almost like little dimples. I know last year we were doing this and we were using a parachute blue winged olive and catching them. And, oh, there goes one right here, real close. Let's see if I can get him real quick. You would never see that across the river. Let me see. He was really close. I might have to switch to something smaller. Oh, he's coming. He got it. Oh! He didn't get it. He followed it. He followed that thing for like 10 feet. <laughs> followed it for like 10 feet. He didn't want to take it. Which, you know what? I guess I got to switch over. Let me switch over. Hey guys, one showed himself. Might have been the same fish, but let's see if I can get it down here. Right there. Right there he is. Oh, he got it. Got him. <laughs> There you go, man. As long as they show themselves, I'll get them buggers. Oop, he got off. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, well. That was cool. Okay. I'm going to show you. Well, I already showed you the fly, but I'll show it to you again. It's pretty wet now. Let me get my line out. Okay. There he is. CDC caddis. Let me dry him off though. Okay? I'll be right back. 